A group of German scientists discovered a city estimated to be 3,400 years old. It may be the city of Zakiku, which was located on the banks of the Tigris River and was an important center of the ancient empire of Mitanni, which existed between 1550 and 1350 BC. The fact is that the ruins of the ancient city, which is believed to have been destroyed by an earthquake in 1350 BC, are flooded by the waters of the Mosul Reservoir, which is near the city of Mosul in northern Iraq. Because Iraq suffers from a severe drought, the reservoir's waters are used to save farmland. Therefore, the water level in the reservoir dropped significantly for some time. German scientists took this opportunity to conduct a thorough study of the ruins of buildings that once stood on the territory of a city that belonged to the Mitanni Empire. This state occupied the territory of modern Iraq, Syria, and Turkey. In a short period, archaeologists were able to map the ancient city. They also discovered the ruins of a palace and several preserved rooms with frescoes on walls. The archaeologists also excavated several other large structures, a massive fortification with a wall and towers, a monumental multi-story warehouse with a store, and an industrial complex. We believe, considering the enormous size of the warehouse, that a great many goods were stored here, possibly brought in from various corners of the empire. The results of our excavations suggest that this city was an important center of the Mitanni Empire, says an expert from the University of Freiburg. The scientists were particularly surprised by the well-preserved walls of the buildings, which are several meters high. After all, these buildings were built of fired clay bricks and were submerged for more than 40 years. According to scientists, perhaps the walls are so well-preserved because before the flooding of these buildings after the earthquake a few thousand years ago, were buried under a layer of top parts of the collapsed buildings. Archaeologists found several clay vessels at the site of the excavations, with more than 100 well-preserved cuneiform clay tablets. Some of them date back to the period of the Mitanni Empire, others to a later period in the time of the Assyrian Empire. It shows that there was still a settlement on this site even after the destruction. It is a miracle that the clay plates survived so well after so many years underwater. We hope that after studying them we will be able to learn more about the final period of the city of Mitanni and what it was like when Assyria ruled the region, says another scholar. To preserve the discovered buildings from further destruction, the scientists covered the findings with special plastic sheeting and covered them with gravel. This will also help to preserve yet undiscovered structures and artifacts on the territory of the ancient city, the scientists believe. Currently, the reservoir is filled with water again, and further research is not possible yet.